everybody and welcome to episode 8 of TV Movie Trivia. Here are questions from last week. Question number one. In what film does Forrest Whitaker play a samurai mafia hitman? And the answer is Ghost Dog, The Way of the Samurai. Question number two. Tom Cruise is nearly the last man standing in this Japanese swashbuckler. The answer, the last samurai. Question number three. In which 2001 Oscar winner did sword fights take place in midair? And the answer is crouching tiger, hidden dragon. And question number four. This influential 1954 Japanese classic was remade in America as The Magnificent Seven. And the answer is The Seven Samurai. And our winners were... <clears throat> we only have three winners this week. In third place, Melissa C. with a total of five points. Second place, Destiny Swan, also with a total of five points. And in first place, Terry Johnson, with a total of nine points. Congratulations to all you guys, and congratulations to everybody who played. We're going to make just a slight change to the schedule. Your answers will need to be in on Monday e or Sunday evenings by midnight in order for me to make sure that the video with the new week's questions gets posted every Monday by 8 p.m. I am trying to keep it on an exact time schedule this way everybody will know exactly when the video is to be posted. So remember your answers need to be in by Sunday at midnight in order for me to post the video by 8 p.m. on Monday evening, California time. So, remember that. Now let's pick a card for this week, guys. What should we do? Let's see. This is a potluck card. Question number one. In what Oscar-winning film about two murderesses does Catherine Zeta-Jones perform all that jazz? Question number two. On the sitcom Seinfeld, what was the first name of Jerry's neighbor, Jerry's neighbor Kramer? Question number three. What is the longest-running program on Comedy Central winning eight Teen Prime Time Emmy Awards. And question number four. What term describes TV shows that are produced for and are intended to be viewed online? There you have it, your four questions for this week. Make sure to have those answers in Sunday night by midnight, and we We'll see you next week on another episode of TV Movie Trivia. Bye!